August 29, 2024. This is session 1241 of the Inner Journeys through the Omega Communications Portal. Hello, Lani speaking with you and again I welcome you into the space, into another deep inner journey of you, of yourself. And the more deeply that you travel within yourself, you encounter the entire creative energy field. And this is what we might call the quantum self. So let's feel that we are the quantum self. And as the quantum self, we are conscious of everything. And so it's the conscious self now that we gather together as, and we gather in that collective space known as the Station of Light. Are you with me? It's very simple. When we let go of our thought patterns that might work against what our true cosmic self is wanting to do and express. So today, perhaps, Aram and the collective beings will explain more about this or something else that we need today. Let's begin. Already you have been received and are welcomed in this space, or I'm addressing you. And of course, this is an area known as the quantum field that you have entered. The quantum field entertains all logical explanations, and more than that, It contains all of the elementary and basic substances and information patterns for all creation. Therefore, you might feel that you are one of billions of people on the planet form, but indeed you are one with the cosmic collective life force and the presentation of consciousness through all of life, everywhere. And you are coexisting within that quantum field. Perhaps you could divide it up into thinking, well, this field uh, contaminated and that field uh, at cross purposes with each other and that field is... Uh, greeding and accumulating certain things. And yet, none of that matters when you come into the realization that you are a quantum field, you are a compilation of many experiences, and the experiences that you are currently aware of are self-generated and are automatically generated by you linking in to other specific fields of consciousness. What we are saying is, choose the field of consciousness that you would associate yourself with and that you would want to create around you in your life. There will be others who will be wanting to create the same field and the constitution of that field that you would be wanting to exist within is already present and it is presented by other individuals who in common language would say other like-minded people. This is the experience you are having of choice. Therefore, what are you choosing to create? and to expand your livingness into and to experience altogether a change perhaps in country circumstances, the experience of particular countries, 
the experiences of the entire biosphere of the planet form. What are you connecting into? The beauty or something else? Are you connecting into the beauty of your prime creation of you, the cosmic intelligent field from which you arose and you came from that cosmic intelligence? When you go deeply within yourself, you come to that center of realization that you are the cosmic intelligence and you are the quantumness of your experiences and you are therefore readjusting many of those experiences because you are the quantum field embracing it all and you are able to shift specific fields of experience away from you You will have experienced this in your current lifetime where you felt certain episodes of experience uh, lost chapters in your storybook of life. They're not lost, you just have no need for them in your new experience of new creation. This is ongoing. We speak to you again about the supportive field that you are within. The supportive field incorporates and brings around you and has the availability for you to access all means of support for you. That might mean explanations, it might mean uh, material goods, it might mean actual nutritional aspects, it might mean many different things that you have access to. Mostly you have individual needs that become apparent as a discomfort or um, disorder in some way in your viewpoint of life, in your viewpoint of your uh, physical systems. So this is why we incorporate many of these practical solutions for you and the information patterns for you to utilize yourself. Inherently, you are a cosmic being alongside us. We have this opportunity to come forward to you in this frequency pattern that you have entered to present these aspects of creation for your consideration and what you would wish to experience and draw into you to experience. The perfect plan, you might think about that, What is the perfect plan for you? If it's a perfect plan for you, would that be the perfect plan for the planet form and the inhabitants? When you move into a field such as that, you would sense an alignment process happening. As if you turn in a direction where you are completely enveloped in fields and frequencies that you identify in your language as light with all of the energy and information required. If you do that, if you view the planet form as you being present vitally, essentially an element that is your presence, you might then understand the effect you have on what is around you. As we gave to you in the previous gathering, you are the receiver of the prime source of energy and information. So we remind you again of that. And every reminder opens you to more realizations of what you are 
in the quantum field of creation. Because you are aware of creation and the quantum field that embraces all around your biosphere and it embraces the quantum field of all creation, then your viewpoint again changes. And from a different perspective, you change your thought patterns. And it is you who changes your thought patterns. Because you view things from a clear perspective, not something that has been engineered for you to think in a certain way. So detaching yourself from that brings you into the prime sense of creation and your ability to create and to alter even certain mechanisms you might think of that occur within your body form and around you in the environment. There are some natural recycling elements that occur in a biosphere. You will be aware of that. And everything is able to be repaired and a continuation of the vitality until it is interfered with or damaged. And then necessary repair systems will come in through the vital connections to the frequency patterns of the cosmic creative life force, which in a sense you may feel is surrounding the Earth biosphere and is indeed It's from the quantum creation field, that energy matrix field surrounding everywhere. You are not limited by that, of course. You are not limited by what you may feel the Earth biosphere is. You are accessing, because of your supreme consciousness, your quantum consciousness, you are accessing the quantum field of creation, the pureness, above everything, above the treetops, above the cloud level, above where you feel the moon is stationed. So you see, you could be feeling free. Are you feeling free to expand the consciousness field that you are. Do you feel free to enter this space with us and communicate with the different groups here who oversee what is happening all around you and the Earth biosphere and the other planetary systems now that you are able to view through current technology? This is all observed. Remember not to create through other people's fantasies and creations. Remember to keep yourself stable, connected freely into the prime sense of the quantumness of creation. And there is order within that. Change, you might say, comes out of chaos, out of disorder. And yet there is the focus needed on the prime source of all creation. Creation happens naturally. It does not need to happen out of a chaotic or dysfunctioning apparent system. Creativeness coexists as an aspect of quantum source creation. And here you are enveloped in that field. 
you may observe when you connect with certain of the other beings stationed here in the station that there are activities that are existing that you could participate in or you have already participated in as you could be projected from an oversight into an area where you can sense a developing situation. You might have presented yourself as a quantum intelligent field and that energy that you present is a system that can be consciously connected into by other life forms and the apparent existence and stabilization or creation. So it's very important for you to remain very clearly connected to the quantum consciousness field in its simplicity, in its pureness. And you will indeed gravitate because it's a natural resonating effect with the correctness of all creation. This is an automatic response in you in the frequency fields functioning throughout your life system. This is a necessary element and this is a component of what you receive when you enter this space with us. It is freely presented to you and offered to you. And you have already realized this and you are actively participating in the expansion of you and yourself and the self-supporting frequencies for the life form to sustain your presence in the expansion of a consciousness of the planet form where you are. And we are speaking to you, some of you as present on the Earth station planet form and others present elsewhere on other planet forms. It is the same situation and message. And we present this to you in support of you in every way. Thus our deliverance in this gathering is complete. Orem out. Lani again speaking and thank you Orem and the supporting field of the many who came forward presenting this around us so that we could understand and move and change ourselves. So it's always wonderful to receive this information and I always enjoy feeling your presence with me, all of you who come in. Now it's time to bring all of it around you again, back into where you are stationed, receiving it wherever you are, where your body is stationed, that's your vessel. So it would be interesting if some of you who are stationed travelling throughout the cosmos somewhere, existing on some other different planet life form. Fascinating. Perhaps this is an aspect of you existing in parallel dimensions and realities. It's a wonderful thing to consider your conscious presence everywhere. Now bring your presence consciously present where you are so that you realize the necessity of being consciously present wherever you are. Whether it's as you're listening to this, whether it's when you're out mingling with other people in some way. 
it's important to be consciously present. This ends this session through the Omega Communications Portal.